What's the best size of position? Let's imagine a very good scenario for a bear trader. He's here. Perfect head and shoulders have been formed. Bear, bear rever uh, 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 a reversal head and shoulders. Inclined to sell here. Stop loss is there. How big a position should he, should he have? One approach might be, and it's one of a million different sorts of approaches, is that a set percentage of his trading capital is placed at risk on every trade. Imagine the market goes on and he has a bit of, he, he, his minimum likely move is down to about here. Imagine the market goes to there. He might then move his stop loss to the get-in level, in which case he's got a free trade, in my view. The worst that can happen is the market and he's out for square. So then he might want to add on to his position if he still seals good, because he still thinks there's some profit to be got from the trade. His average is here, but his stop loss is there. In that way, you might want to add on to the position. You've moved the stop loss to here, and you've got a free trade in some sense. Well, you ha this is a free trade. This is a new trade that has to be traded on its own merits. That's the crux. The new trade must be traded on its own merits. So, for example, if you have a triangle, uh, oh, a triangle here, then you might want to add on to. You might not want to add on there. You might want to add on there. 